Well, are the Plume Wi-Fi pods worth it? In this video, I'm going to explain my real life experience with them. My ISP sent me some Wi-Fi mesh devices, and this is called Plume, and uh, it has a couple ports here for Ethernet. So basically, um, they sent me two of them, and one of them is right by my router, and it's plugged in to the router. It's like the base module, and the second one, which they both look identical, um, but the second one is the one I'm holding in my hand. And this one, I just plug into an outlet and it connects to the base module to extend the Wi-Fi. So the idea is if you are in a large house or you have a small, you know, low powered Wi-Fi router um, and you can't get Wi-Fi in some of your rooms, then you could bring one of those pods and put it in the room and then it would extend the Wi-Fi. So you're probably already familiar with that concept, but I just wanted to test how that compared, like how it really affected my performance. Um, so I just tried on a couple different computers. Um, this is a bit of an older computer, so it has a slower like uh, bandwidth limit. Um, but I didn't really see any improvement. Uh, basically, I would run the speed test and then unplug the module and run the speed test again, get about the same. Um, now on, on a n newer computer um, where I was, it was getting more like 330 megabits per second without the module and then with it plugged in about 400. So that is a bit of a, that is a difference. Um, but of course, at those Wi-Fi rates, like, it doesn't really matter. Um, any, like, 40, I can do pretty much anything with 45 megabits per second. Um, so, overall, I would say, um, I'm not really that impressed, or maybe just, maybe I just, I'm not in a situation where I even need Wi-Fi extenders and sometimes that's just something you don't know whether or not they'll help until you actually get to try them. Um, so yeah I'd say in this case the Wi-Fi extender wasn't like a bottleneck or something in the system. Um, 